Well, we're back again, more of the, the pre race show here again tonight. Thanks to Dirt Race Central for doing this here again. Uh, again, Ben does such a great job of filming these things. Uh, night two, of course, uh, the king of the dirt. I got a guy here that's a, a two time former Ahmad national champion, Blake Jeffings, with us here tonight. And, uh, you know, Blake, too, uh, you go back a few years. Let's talk about how many years you've been doing this. Oh, it's been a long time. Uh, my 16th year. You know what I think? Did you start out like in those little mini stocks or something? Yeah, I had a Ford Mustang. Wow, that's amazing! Jumped up. I remember. I remember you come down. You'd have a super stock some nights with. Uh, you have been in a late model. Uh, you run about every kind of car there is. Yeah, I was pretty fortunate there for a while, but uh, other things kind of got in the way and uh, run out of time. Uh, and you know, nice thing, and you, you're such a fitness modified, uh, a tough break here. Uh, a shocker here a week ago, remember? Uh, looks like you've dominated. Of course, you blew the guys away the next night down at Viking and Alexander, but uh, that last lap here uh, a week ago was crazy here as you come out. It looks like the thing's up. All of a sudden, big bang. What really all happened there? I don't know, I just got all tight, and I remember thinking, I better not do that again. And went into the next corner, and this truck for about 30 feet, and got moved, and very, very exploded, and right in the neck. You know, and like you said, it was crazy, folks. The vibration in the car was just amazing, just like you blown an engine. Yeah, I thought, I shut the motor off. I thought it would look. I didn't know what happened. Wow, was that something? Okay, okay on the side, too, are you still doing some chassis work and building some chassis, things like that? Yeah, a little bit, I guess. Not, not a whole lot. But, uh, a couple of our friends got to be on. I don't know what I have, but most of us do this deal with Jimmy. And that's a good race car, but like I said, nice to, and it's good for him because he's got your experience. He can feed off down there and send me back the information uh, uh, also on these cars. Yeah, it seems to work out pretty good. And pretty you guys are no, I don't think it's pretty smart. And uh, it's really nice having that help. You know, sometimes nobody knows what to do with it. Yes, I mean. You know, you, you're basically you know, probably the problem that we can imagine. Yeah, I usually talk to the phone speaker, really. You know, take it. I talk a little bit about family here too. Uh, I mean, yeah, your mom and dad are really cool. I tell you what, uh, his dad, of course, very successful businessman as you are. But uh, how important they've been for you, also. Like, oh, if I wasn't for them, I wouldn't be racing. Oh, they're good people. I tell you, they love coming here. And, and I, I know I sit and watch when, you, when you're racing. I get Viking. Your dad's up the stands, just sits and watches things. When it comes out, and, uh, see how much you say when you get done. Oh no, not too bad. Uh, sometimes I just think we all have our. Uh, on your mom's such a sweetie of course she keeps the rest of you guys in line there too but well, again same thing for you coming up as, as we wind this thing down here for us uh, tonight you've won this uh, like i said you won some big races in your career uh, this would be a pretty nice finish here again tonight wouldn't it yeah we can knock this one off it'd be a pretty good year and, uh, it's struggling a lot with you with this dumb luck stuff Well, I guess if anybody's going to be, don't be surprised if we don't see him here later on. And of course, it's luck of the draw. I don't know what we got for car calling here. I figured it'll be a good full field of 24, 25 cars, my folks. But uh, again, Blake, as we get a chance to wind this down a little bit, uh, fall coming up here. We got any plans for the fall specials or anything in the corn cobs or maybe going out to all west or anything like that? No, we're going to go to, uh, I guess we'll do the corn cobs at the uh, site's memorial race. We got mods Well, I'll tell you what, I appreciate everything you've done. Well, like I said, like I said, you two have sold a lot of race tickets for us racetracks, so keep up the good work, everybody, okay? Well, we'll try it. There ain't fans in the stands, we ain't gonna be driving on the circus for real. That's for sure we need it, don't we? Well, thanks a lot again, Blake Jeff. I appreciate him taking some time to visit us here tonight.